his staff visited Lizzie and we were so excited to have them here. Um, we were able to share with them some of the great things that happen at Lizzie and some of our great programs. Um, we are a STEM certified school, so we got to talk about that and share some of the great things we do here. And we're really excited we were able to share with the team about our community and all of our supports and how wonderful our students, staff, and parents are. And one thing I love about LibZ is all the extra classes here. There are just so many extra classes for kids who need a little bit extra help with their learning. And one of my personal favorites is theater, there's Girls Who Game, Girls Who Code. So many activities, not only in school, but out of school. There's the color run, screen on the green. They're all just really fun. It's very important for the superintendent to come out to the schools and visit so he can be aware of what's going on and the supports we need and to be involved and um, hear from the community and the teachers and the staff. So we're really um, happy that he was able to do that today. Midvale is a super unique and diverse school. Um, it's one of our biggest strengths is our diversity. Um, we are the first IB and STEM certified school in uh, the state of Georgia and it was great to share about our school with Dr. Horton and his staff and just let them know what makes Midvale so special and unique. Uh, and I'm going to turn it over to Chief Palmer. Thank you, Dr. Horton. First off, thank you all for the opportunity to really collaborate and connect and hear about the amazing things that's happening at Midvale and some of the things that we can help support on from the district level. One of the things that I do in my role as a Chief of Staff is a, a lot of what you're speaking on, my job is to get it to the to the division chief. There's 13 divisions across the district, going from HR to chief operations officer, CFO, and what I'm hearing, I'm gonna get it in, into the hands of the chief and they're gonna have to put together a plan to address it. Some's gonna be right away, or some may be next school year, but you all have been heard, you all are valued, so we appreciate this opportunity. Uh, this is a H pride visit, so we take pride in making sure that we're gonna come in and operate under our six core values. It's apparent that you all are doing the same thing. H, humanization. I'm hearing about the diversity of the school, taking pride in culture, culture awareness month. Sounds awesome. These are things that you know th that you all are exhibiting that lets me know that you all are operating with H pride. Just being professional and respectful in your delivery, the things that we need to improve on. Hearing the experiences as you as a bookkeeper, I'm sad to see that we're losing you because we're not meeting that compensation piece, but these are things we're gonna go back to the drawing board so that we're not losing our bookkeepers across the district. So I do wish you well, but just know that you have been heard today and we're gonna make sure that we're putting it at the forefront. Just being intentional on operating with integrity and dignity. You know, I understand that who wants to come to school and, and test right away. But I'm glad you heard, I heard you, but you heard what the reason what our superintendent expressed. But we're gonna also go back and say, hey, even though we've scored high, what's this the best possible solution coming from summer break? So you all heard. And that, and that empathy piece, you know, just, just putting, putting our, yourselves in the shoes of others. And it's clear that you all are exhibiting all of our six core values. So I wanna thank you for this. So uh, we want to make sure that we're able to leave you with something. Every time we come to a school and we had this opportunity to hear about the amazing things that's happening and the things that we need to improve on from the district level. So we've heard you, we value you, we've collaborated. So there's nothing left to say besides that Midvale Elementary School is now H Prize certified. It was really great to have Dr. Horton and his team here. Um, my assistant principal actually said this is the first superintendent that he's ever met in real life. Um, so that was a huge celebration. It was great having him come into the school and talk with us um, because we're able to have a really candid conversation about what's going well and things that we feel that at the local school level might um, not be seen at the district level and to just really, you know, make that connection.